Well, you can change the O2 sensors with the vehicle on the ground. It makes it a lot easier if you safely raise and support it first. Please follow the link provided at the end of this video for additional assistance with this task. Working under the right side of the car, we see two oxygen sensors, green arrows, that give the oxygen content before and after the catalytic converters. There are two more just like it on the left side. We're going to do the right side, but the left side is similar. This photo illustrates under the left side of an E39 with a six cylinder looking underneath the middle of it. Locate the black cover, green arrow, that houses the rear O2 sensor connectors. About halfway back on the left side, you're going to find the black cover, green arrow, that houses the oxygen sensor connectors on the 8-cylinder E39. Remove the two 10mm plastic fasteners that hold the oxygen sensor connector housing to the body of the car. Remove the oxygen sensor wiring harness from the connector clips that attach the wiring to the heat shield. Flip over the connector housing and pull out the two electrical connectors, green arrows, one for each oxygen sensor. Squeeze the end of the electrical connector, green arrow, and slide the body of the electrical connector, yellow arrow, and pull the two connectors straight apart. With a 22mm wrench or crow foot, loosen the oxygen sensor in the housing. The sensor may be on there really tight you may need to apply heat to loosen it. You should use a special oxygen sensor wrench or socket that allows you to put it around the oxygen sensor and get past the wiring harness. That's a crow foot wrench. Working underneath the six cylinder E39 where the exhaust manifold meets the downpipe, install your 22 millimeter craw foot and remove the two O2 sensors. Use your 22 millimeter wrench or an O2 sensor socket and remove the two post catalytic converter O2 sensors. Your new O2 sensor should come with a little bit of copper paste on the threads already. If it doesn't, apply a little before installing. Installation is the reverse of removal. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.